Black Box Productions. 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 Black
I seen him on here doing his YouTube thing. I wasn't aware of him. I am fully aware of his presence and what he means to the whole culture or the whole, you know, Compton card, the gangster card, the moving, the, the whole situation, the machine of motion, cuz name ain't no joke out here. You don't, if, you, if you're a native, you know that, right? So much so that I was shocked to see how he entertained and engaged in the conversation about this boxing match as in regards to me and how casual he had my name in his mouth and how comfortable he was being facetious or lighthearted about the subject matter um, when I consider everything that there is to consider. And I'm going to break it down to he who has an ear, let him hear, because this ain't going to be for everybody to get. Now, just mind you, um, because of inspiration, Turtle, rest in peace, from um, Santana has hosted one of my mixtapes back in the day. Not voluntarily. Um, I got a hold to a DVD at one point, which was like an archive that a lot of people wasn't um, aware of, which has become very popular since then. But it featured uh, Turtle from Santana, um, Twin, and a lot of their homies back in like 84. And it was like a documentary type interview they was doing with a white dude. And there was some real G shit on there and some real cold sound bites. And just on a creative level back in the day, I decided to allow Turtle to host one of my mixtapes by using the, some of the sound bites that um, impressed me from the, the, uh, the uh, mixtape, I mean from the uh, DVD. I can remember at one point being out in Hollywood because at a function, moving around the club, and I got the little homies passing out the mixtape. There was some G niggas from Santana in there, and they got the mixtape. They must have read the cover to my hosted by OG uh, Turtle from Santana. Cause they got it, and they pressed the nigga in the club. I ain't gonna lie. They hadn't heard the music. They was there. Y'all know who y'all is if y'all still alive. Two G niggas that got at me that night, cause and you know I wasn't big, too big to explain myself. They understood what I explained, and then after they went and heard it, you know it was generally accepted by that whole section. However. My homie little AJ from Santana kind of fell up under some like little pressure and politics for when it, when they found out that's where I got the DVD. It's 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 all over the internet now, but back then it was like an archive DVD that wasn't really known, and they kind of held that precious to they to they soul because Cuz is a cold nigga out here, right? And um, some niggas was on my nigga head about giving me that DVD because he let them know where, where I got it from. Shout out to little AJ, but anyway. Uh, I'm, I'm fully aware of uh, uh, who Baby Gangsta is. So I see him doing his YouTube thing. I'm at work last night. And when I'm at work, I typically like to tune in to a, a, a long piece of content and just put it in my AirPod. I was in a UTR just hitting, you know, driving around the yard all night. And when you look at something that's an hour long or two hours long, just in your mind, you know, once you finish with it, you knock down an hour or two hours. So I seen a title saying reaction to the Nina Boy and Bosco fight. And I see the nigga on there. I don't know this is Baby Gangster. Although I'm fully aware of who Cuz is and all that, I don't know this is Cuz. I'm just tapping in because it's an hour plus and it's on that title. Let me see what Cuz got to say. And lo and behold, as I'm listening, um, y'all know how I learned this lesson. You, you realize now, I don't really pay attention to the chat. I, I solicit the same comments that I would respond to um, on the um, chat now I, I allow people to submit them to my DM and then I, I go through them and I pick which ones I'm going to discuss versus then reading them in real time because um, I experienced uh, I experienced not really being um, pleased with all the things that I responded to in real time some of the things I said some of the things that had I thought about it, I probably wouldn't address at all. But I had gotten the habit of just reading comments out loud and then just coming off the cuff. And shout out to you, baby gangster. Much love, cuz. You a legend, cuz. But I just want to give you a few pointers. I've been doing this a lot longer than you, right? And it's just funny how I see people get caught up on this internet thing, cuz. You got to be careful about how you utilize certain individuals' names, what type of things you promote, entertain, because it's not just the way it reflects on me, but the way it reflects on you. I watched your whole life, and every time it appeared that somebody mentioned me in your chat, 
about this fight with minutes you was reading the question in real time and you just being candid and casual and you responded in real time but you like oh minutes called out spotted low you like yeah first of all i want to acknowledge and observe and announce it's an honor for someone of your statue to even mention my name so casually without i you know i would think i was born in Compton, because on my mama mama my birth certificate born in Compton, so i know what you mean to the section so i grew up to a large degree admiring your reputation not knowing you as an individual correct so for me to realize that you see my name unexpectedly and you're not having to say damn spider loco is that for one that's an honor cuz on crip but for then you an original cc rider type nigga cuz to engage a concept y'all ain't got no bloods in Compton, bro a paru boxing match and you you feel like you was having seemed like you was having a lot of fun with it kiki in like it was a cute concept uh a paru which is your basically your whole career that's your enemies paru to you is funny that a paru you was talking about 4800 and how original cripping go when is it cool, cute for a Pyro to be just throwing a Crip name around to a corny ass boxing match that he ain't, that ain't got no smut? Like, that's why I stopped reading comments in real time and reading. I like to think about what I say. I'm very familiar with your name because I'm familiar with your set, your section. I grew up a large part of my life being at 920 North Spring. I know Lil AJ, Big AJ. A lot of people, I know a lot of the Chester Streets, I know the whole story. If you really want to be familiar with the character of an individual I am, ask your little bro. I know y'all might not be seeing eye to eye, but ask Quintana, cuz, about what type of nigga I am, cuz, inside the system. Yeah, when it's time that we can't sleep, or we can't all sleep tonight, we got to sleep in shifts. Guess why? Because I triggered it. I'm that one that get off where I get mad at. Ask your little bro, cuz. I got the same type of name that I know you have established that can't no outsider of the Crip car trigger me to be on my platform playing with your name, cuz. You know, I know a lot of people that you know. We share a lot of common energy. Certain females who names in the indicator color. You feel me? A color that's familiar with Crip. It. Not all black, though. You feel me? We got peoples that ask your little bro, cuz. I'm like, I'm with all the shits, cuz. And I just, you, and, and by the way, you know why cuz look like he got, why Asmo look like he got real bigger? ECIP to the homie Asmo, cuz. That's not Asmo, that's his son, cuz. So you reading them comments and you reading it, and then you, now you reading the comment, somebody say that's Asmo. And now you taking that as a fact. You talking about Al Asma was way littler back in 84. Guess what? Asma wasn't born in 84. If he was, he was in diapers. That's cuz son. That's infant Asma. And as original as your cripping is that go back to 4,800 and four sacks and all that, cuz, you ought to know there is no way that somebody that you've heard my name as many years as you have, no smut, there is no way some nobody can jump up on TV associate my cripping with a boxing match and suggest that the boot might be somewhere in the possible cards your cripping is more authentic than that i would imagine somebody like baby gangster as soon as he heard that would be automatically no like that sound like boo boo how somebody gonna be officially affiliated with something like the coast Guard, and then just one random homie out of nowhere announced that if he don't come <laughs> now you're on the internet baby gangster so you just set yourself up to see so you're telling me no matter how many people on the internet start want to call you off for of boxing matches, you finna go on a boxing tour? That's all I'm saying. I refuse to be disrespectful towards you just based on the legend you are. And like I say, I looked up to your cripping all my life before I even ever met you because everything your set represent get nothing but high stripes and honor from me. But I believe that we can all learn from anyone, especially one from the other. And you gotta be careful uh, how you just react real time on the internet. Just think about it, cuz you don't want niggas playing with your name on this motherfucker. It's a lot that circulates around the streets 
associated with your name. Things, you know, connected to your health. All type of things that I would never just bring to the internet and be loose about, cuz. So, I just want to respectfully uh, petition you to think a little more next time my name come up, cuz. Because I'm going to be very cautious and careful how I handle your name on my mama mama. What's happening? Hey, hey, check this out, check this out. <laughs> All my life, like what it is, though. From my mama house to my daddy house, it was like straight up century. I'ma tell you how it is. I was raised by the streets. Yeah. I'm known yeah. from the west to the east. Like 156 to. What a clip say was cracked. 99 Blood Street. Blood say was cracked, and I ain't turning down my hand. That's how you do it, like that. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a clip say was cracked. The blood say was cracked, and I ain't turning down my hand. Head to toe like a bang Santana clan of antennas on the scanner when it's time to trip. Can I be a Los Angeles loke and a concrete trip? No brain, head paid mag, chomping on tracks. First rap on the map, just say bumping on wax. Relax and get your whole group beat by boot. By SPI, Boodaroo, and Tree Top Troop. True 1597, fucking with the 400s. Wanna run it in? I'ma let the whole fun it all on a bitch, boy. Break a nigga face. Biggest mistake to think you can ever take a nigga play. You see, I came up with some CC riders. Cause watch a cack at the center divider here in Tyler Pot and Chill. My track, new G homies. G ask the streets about me. I'm a G homie. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was cracking. I ain't turning down mountains head. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was cracking. I ain't turning down mountains head. I'm a play ball, SPI, AD, fucking with the 400, no bleak, really in the trenches, but I'm strapped when I do it, and money is the mold, be able to tape how I rule, who said ain't black, West trees, why do it, so nigga watch your ass, at the center of the vibe, been getting dope, hella active, can't change ways, but I all I know, who wanna play games, I'm thinking nobody, really catch a body, I don't fuck with these niggas, this be fucking with these niggas, real street baby, really get it baby, when I show up, I show out, a nigga need a bag, stick a nigga out, Stop that video, so who talking? Nigga had to get it, so I'ma tell you how I did it. Put more action. West side really ride. I'ma tell you how it is. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was bragging. I ain't turning down mountains head. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was bragging. I ain't turning down mountains head. She get ugly at any minute, hit the club and dust security, sneaking to see me in it. One time's coming, we gon' floor a Chevy, got to hear me in it. It was cracking in the hood, they would say that 20 did enough. Kill it on these tracks, I know Flow, he got my back. Sock and Dolo with the strap, SBI with that big Mac. Look, watch a couple stacks, got it better read the stats. When I'm rapping, it's the truth, every line I speak is back. Look, my mama said my homies was a bad look. We was hitting schools, trying to steal a couple MacBooks. I was always that nigga to try to rumble up with it, put a lot of niggas on their ass. I'm a sexy look. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was bragging. I ain't turning down mountains head. I was raised by the streets. I'm known from the west to the east. What a crib say was cracking. The blood say was bragging. I ain't turning down mountains head. Shout out Compton ID. RIP 400, you said that wrong, Tony Wong. Snake with Nip Hustle. Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All that. It was point blank, through no subliminal dissing. When I listen, I could tell you never been on no mission. Sticking to the script, don't care if I offend you. Neighborhood crib, the marathon. I hope I look my team. competition, never seeing him. I done dream my mind that I'm going. You could tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss. A east side millionaire, hold me what you got. My life is a movie, they can't get close to me. They mad cause they can't be. I'm everything that they wanna be, yeah.